Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Project Ascension. Today we're checking out the Stormborn Mystic Enchant. This enchant brings ore right into World of Warcraft. Starting off, you're going to need a talent called Elemental Mastery. Now this generally is an Elemental Shaman ability. A talent in the talent tree towards the bottom, level 40. And this one, instead of giving you Spell Haste, it's going to give you Melee Haste. Which is insane, especially for Shaman. Especially if you can throw it with some Wind Fury. What I like to do is the Wind Fury Totem and then the Frostbrand Weapon Enhancements from the Shaman Tree. This one's very good, especially in PvP because you're going to have the constant slow. We did also roll with a Seal and a Judgment. Now we ended up with the Seal of Light. It wasn't our first way to go. We had the Seal of Mana, forget what it's called. That one is really good, but when we had the Procedure a few times, we weren't able to retain that one. But the Judgment is really good. We have the Judgment of Justice for the extra slow, especially when they're just out of range. Some of those faster movers like the Hunters and stuff, they, they are a deal breaker for most PvP. This guy isn't too bad. He has a lot of sustain, a lot of damage. A lot of the damage isn't all burst, even though he does have a decent burst. We also got a cool ability known as Light's Hammer. This has a really cool effect. You throw the hammer to the ground, you damage and you do healing. Really cool little ability, ties right into the Thor part. Now another big part of this enchant is that it gives you a 20% bonus damage of your attack power to your main abilities such as Lightning Bolt, Chain Lightning, and your Shield Orbs. Which another thing that we have is called Static Shock. Now it's a talent in the Enhancement Tree as well as you can get the Mystic Enchant for it. And this one will give you an extra six charges on your lightning shield. Your storm strike recharges three of them. Plus you have a 21% chance per hit to do damage with your shield without having to take damage. So when you're just slapping it along with your storm strike, you're regenerating your lightning orbs. Plus you're sending them out doing extra damage, an extra 20% of your attack power. So the majority of this build, you want to pump that attack power as much as you can. Crit comes in handy a lot because we got the Maelstrom weapon. That one's really good for throwing out those lightning bolts, lava burst, chain lightning, or the heal to keep yourself sustained. And that one comes in handy a lot. It's only three points in the talent tree of the enhancement. Definitely well worth it. Other than that, we went with the uh, Shamanistic Rage. This one gives you 15% mana regen per attack power for 15 seconds. And uh, that one really gives you a lot to pull up your mana because with throwing out lightning bolts, throwing out heals, shocks, all that good stuff, you lose mana very quickly. Um, the seal of mana that we were going with was really nice. I think it's a seal of wisdom or something. We also got the uh, blessing of wisdom, which was pretty good. We got the uh, arcane intellect and then the battleship. Another one that was kind of tied into the Thor aesthetic was the hammer of wrath. Good execute there. And plus it was a cool little animation. Now another factor of this mystic enchant is your elemental mastery, your main big burst. That one has a lot of different abilities that will give you a cooldown reduction on that. So your lightning bolt and your chain lightning, when you use them with the maelstrom, they'll give you a 3 second reduction on that ability. And then your lightning shield orbs, when they do damage, you also get some reduction on that. So that's going to help you keep a lot of damage, a lot of uptime on that ability. So you'll get those AoE attacks with your storm strike. Plus your Storm Strike's cooldown is halved when you're in that Elemental Mastery ability buff. Now overall I had a lot of fun with this build. I absolutely love the Thor aesthetic that it comes with. Some of the custom abilities, you'll see I just threw the hammer there which is healing me and doing damage. Only thing is it could be blue, that'd be cool. But other than that, there's a lot of cool abilities. You'll see in the next match with the arena that I'm in, uh, we use a Storm Strike and you'll see the little ability on the ground, a little blue lightning. I think that's really unique to the class that and then the extra abilities uh, now in pvp he is melee which i enjoy but unfortunately it's just so unbalanced and if you're not out kiting somebody you're not winning which is unfortunate but i still had fun with it you'll see in a second here that i throw down the hammer and then i smack him with a storm strike get that cool little animation cool little ability there I could definitely recommend this enchant if you like melee or melee hybrids i think you'll like it it's a lot of fun to play in my opinion I might come back to it in the future. If there's any other enchants that you'd like to see or have a question about, post it down in the comments and I'll definitely do a build for it or check it out at some point. So stay tuned for that. Always subscribe so you get the latest notifications. You actually see here, I fight this guy a few times that we he just goes AFK and we get a lot of money out of it. So shout out to that guy. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.